What's up everybody? Alex here and we started with an open fort in Dota Underlord Season 1. We are going to roll here. I'm going to take- Ooh, Kea or Voidstone. Might actually take- You know what? I'm going to take Voidstone here. Kea is fantastic too, I'm thinking. I'm going to take Voidstone. Voidstone's a good pick. So I'm after a very specific build here. I am essentially building six mages with uh, Brutes and Luna. So we're going to be doing six mages, Lifestealer and Ogre Magi if possible. And uh, we're going to be running Luna. The idea here is to uh, get uh, Luna to three stars and Eclipse her. Uh, that is the build that I have designed, and I hope that it is going to work. We're the only ones open forting right now, which is absolutely perfect. It's what I want. We do have some contention on Luna, very significant amount of contention, which is a bit of a problem. Uh, a little bit of a problem here, but hopefully we can get some RNG, get these uh, free rerolls going here. I would like to uh, three star Maiden and Razor if I can. Three starring Ogre Magi is fantastic too. Magi is probably better than the others because uh, he can provide a benefit to uh, the Luna, really amplify her, her uh, DPS. So let's see what we can do here. Um, hmm. More contention with Luna than I would have expected. Alright, RNG hates us so far, it's okay. Let's see if we can get- Hey, there's a Maiden, finally, a unit I wanted. Finally pulled a Crystal Maiden here. Would you like a Void Stone? Here you go. Uh, we're going to have to wait here a few moments as uh, we uh, we take another intentional loss. We have no one that we're contesting with in terms of the uh, open forwarding, so we don't have to put any units in, which is A-OK. -okay. But Luna is a problem right now. And of course we're going to get the loss, and I'm going to cut you ahead to round number four. All right, I'm going to hold on to Storm Spirit, but I'm not going to buy him yet. I'm going to have to start to the uh, wait till the start of the round there because I'm going to lock in our interest. Uh, ironically, one of the interesting things about the situation we're in right now, we've only literally bought Maiden. <laughs> Storm Spirit, look at this. Everyone's contested. Everyone's contested, but I'm sticking to my plan. I'm forcing it. I don't care. I'm here to test a very specific strategy. I take the Storm Spirit. I take the free reroll here. I take the Maiden. No problem. No problem. Okay, we took the loss there. It's okay. Five damage. We're going to cut ahead to round five. All right, I am going to take Chrysalis. I actually, you know what? I'm going to roll for Arcane Boots, possibly. Yes, okay, we'll take that. Who wants the boots? You want the boots? You want the boots? You can hold the boots. Rayleigh, you can hold the boots. Let's see what we get here round five. Come on, RNG. Throw us something we can use. And nothing. Kind of what I expected. RNG hates us. Hey, Crystal Maiden. Hello. Thank you, Maiden. Thank you very much. Uh, what I might do here is... Everyone's at four. We're the only ones at three, so I'm actually going to put them in. I'm going to put them in because it'll uh, help hopefully reduce the amount of incoming yeah. damage we get. Uh, the Void Stone should have been on the uh, other guy there. So I totally expect to lose this fight. If I win, I'll actually be totally shocked. But I just want to be able to take down a unit or two and hopefully reduce the amount of in uh, incoming damage that we take. That Nyx is down. The Queen's down. But we're ultimately... Oh, no! Queen's alive! Damn it! But then again, that Nyx Assassin, right? We're trying to uh, ensure that we take minimized damage. We are still going to lose the matches. We want those free rerolls uh, because look at this. Luna's already been two star here, and they're picking up more Lunas. We haven't seen a single one, despite the fact that we've had a significantly more rerolls here. Look at this. We're having some really rough RNG to start this game. Really, really rough. But I got faith. Rayleigh's uncontested right now, and um, I'm sure. Well, Life Stealer, Magi. Who knows? These guys, Mag Magi's right there. Pretty uncontested too. So let's see. Uh, we're gonna take the spirit. We're gonna take the free reroll. Come on, game! Help me out a bit! Okay, we take Razor. Put him there, him here, like this. Actually, we'll do this, he'll activate it right away. We take the Luna. So we gotta reroll a bit at, uh, at level 3. Once we level to 4, I'm just gonna jump right to 5. Uh, maintain a stronger board if we can. Come on, Rayleigh! Oh no! Miss target, and we're taking a big L here. It's okay. Again, I exp I'm expecting to lose. It's no problem. We're basically investing five health for free rerolls. Hopefully, it's like three health. That's kind of what we want. But we're not getting that, are we? We're not getting that at all. Okay. Finally pulled a Luna, though. That's exciting. Nope. Okay, we take the Maiden. We roll right down again. Nope, can't do that. Alright, we do this. 
And I'm gonna hold on to my money for a second. No, I'm not gonna hold on to my money. I gotta do, uh, roll now. As soon as this fight's done, I'll explain why. So I have to roll now, because there's no point in me holding on to my money, because I'm gonna be jumping up the next round. We're after these, uh... You know what? No, I'm gonna save my money. Because realistically, I'm only chasing Razor and Maiden at this point. He's uncontested. Alright, I'm gonna roll. Okay, I'm gonna roll. Okay, worth it. Worth it. Surprisingly worth it. Was not expecting that. But here we are. Here we are, friends. Sometimes a little lucky. We take the Maiden, yes. Abaddon's fantastic too, so now we actually have a pretty decent lineup. Okay, that's what we're gonna do, that's the setup. Put him in too. Cost me a little bit of interest there, but it's fine. I want the Life Stealer. We'll take these guys too. Good. Good, good, good. That's a bit of a run of decent units. It's fine. I decided that um, we gotta start winning now. And look, we will win. We will win. This is when we start to really pull through. And this guy here, Storm Spirit, get out of here. Good win. As soon as we start trying, right? Now, here's the thing, right? So we dropped our Tier 1's odds to 35%, uh, but we're now we're stuck at Tier 2 at 40%. So what we're going to do now is we're trying to conserve our health at level 5 while still re-rolling. Ideally, we would have stayed at 30 but uh, it's okay. So we have these are two guys coming later. I might actually put an Abaddon over. Yeah. We'll do this. Not what I want. Let's roll. Take Vanguard. Vanguard on the Abaddon. We'll put this here. You know what? We'll do this. Okay, Magi. Interesting. All right. I, I trust you. I don't know. Maybe. Do I trust Ogre Magi? Do I trust Ogre Magi? I don't know if I do. So again, I have a very specific set build here, and as you can see, we're starting to fill in certain gaps. Now, we have to be at at least level 9 to finish it. Six mages with uh, Keeper of the Light. Morphling is also part of this build. But the key thing is, is we really want Luna at three stars. She's kind of the, the hidden star of this build. The nice thing about this build is we don't get Luna to three stars. We just have a good unit, or we, uh, we just run six mages. Put Tidehunter in front instead. But I do want to get Luna eclipsing. I do want Luna to uh, get an eclipse going. But she is contested. She's contested and it makes me sad. But that, my friends, is the reality of the video games. Sometimes things don't go your way. Sometimes they do. Usually they don't. But it's okay. I think I can actually through. Ooh, what are we going to take here? Let's go crazy. Not what I want. Honestly, I don't like any of these. I'd rather have a friendly fire hobby in. We didn't pull that, which is a little unfortunate. All attack might be decent. I'm gonna take Eno. I'm taking Eno here. All attack Eno. I'd rather have the. Uh, rather have that little stun there. I'm not contesting any of those units. That's fine. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna take a roll. And we're gonna have to wait. Omni Knight's not a bad idea, but we have an Abba, and I'd rather have Abba because I kind of want. Uh, we don't need Heartless. We don't need Heartless. It's just it works well. The brute, the brute effect with the Life Stealer. It gives us a little nudge in DPS. But the vast majority of our DPS comes from magic damage, of course. Of course, though, Luna, her uh, Moon Glaives will be physical damage. Her Eclipse, magical damage. But uh, so that's why this build. If you min max it, you are running Life Stealer with the Abaddon. There we go. Good attack. Get another win here. Let's take this clown down. Get out of here, Eno. Good win. Boom Good win. That's exactly what I want to see here. A lot of Bloodbound there. Let's check Contention one more time. So, very minimal. Okay, we can still do something with him. Not too concerned. Not concerned at all. This is beautiful. And beautiful as well. So I kind of... Do I regret rolling off a little bit? Maybe. I'm going to actually uh, chase that. We're going to continue rolling. What are they getting here? Oh, Storm Spirit got two star. Luna, oh, see, that's, that's bad. That's exactly what we don't want to see. One more, come on, game. A Luna. So a lot of guys are three uh, two starring units here. The Luna breaks my heart, because that's really going to impact our ability to get her to three stars. It's going to get near impossible soon, unless guys get eliminated. So we're going to have to almost... Three star Rayleigh would be great. It would be fantastic. Can we get there? I might actually move this Voidstone. He's not He's not getting hit. There he is. 
Storm Spirit needs to get tapped a little bit. He needs to get love tapped. Come on, Rayleigh. Another cast. Let's go. Let's go, Frostbite. Yes. It's good. It's good. And look, Eno's eating away at guys. Come on. Oh, a big heal there. Oh, what a clutch heal. Cost us some health there. It was a damn good heal. Luna is really problematic right now. Really problematic. Morphling. Yes, we take the Morphling. So what I might actually do is sell off. I'd rather to get to six mages first. We're gonna sell off Life Stealer for now. Hold the Morphling. Roll. Take that roll. Come on. Yes. Exactly what I want. Whoa. I didn't have a chance to think. I just knew I was running out of time. I was celebrating my maiden, and I have it set, of course, that I'm not gonna get another unit in there. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna keep the uh, the Void Stone on her, of course, because now she has a reduced cooldown. Frostbite is actually going to demolish guys now. And of course we're going to win. Oh, you're stunned. There comes the golem. Get off my crystal maiden, fool. Oh, boom shakalaka. Big win there. We're taking the ogre magi. Here we go. You're going, you know what? I might actually put in. No. No, no, no. Abaddon up front. Abaddon might give us a little more sustain. An extra shield there. I'm thinking. Abaddon up front. I think I'd want Abaddon over the Morphling. Let's see. Let's see how we do here. I'm gonna switch this like that. Uh, you know what? No. Okay, I don't need the boots right now. Yule Scepter is actually kind of interesting. I'm gonna Greed Roll here. Let's see what we get. Oh, Mango Oh, these are awful! Do I want a Mango Tree? I guess. We're running Mages. Let's push back then. Put Eno there, maybe. Okay, we got the Luna. That's something. Might actually put it. I might actually put it in Luna. We don't have a good item for her, but she's gonna be better than Abba at this point. This is weird. Could level, but I do not want to. I do not want to. I want to maintain my tier one. Uh, come on. I want to maintain my tier one odds. The problem is though, we're gonna start losing strength. We've invested a lot of money in rerolling. We've not really have too much to show for. Of course we got a Maiden, which is great. It's gonna allow the uh, Ogre Magi to cast more often, which is fantastic. We're gonna take a loss here. And they're gonna take our Maiden. Oh no, she survived long enough. Are we gonna win? No. No way. I did not, I, you know what? I gotta be honest with you, I did not expect to win that whatsoever. I'm completely shocked. I did not expect to win that. We have an apps. We have an, like no item on Luna right now, and she's crazy contested. Look at the Luna guy up top. Oh, you've got to be kidding me! So this guy gave up on her. This guy gave up on her. We're contesting right here. We can still go after her. He wants that three star, doesn't he? But uh, okay, we can't run him yet. We could. I'll hold him for a sec. You know what? Yeah, we do this. Okay. It's a beautiful day for a storm. I think we're off Life Stealer for the time being. As much as I would love to get Life Stealer in, what we really need to do is three star Ogre Magi, three star Luna. Wow, this guy's hitting us hard. Rayleigh's still up though. Make me proud, Maiden. Make me proud. Good job. Another big win. We are on fire. Things are going well. I might actually have to push to six soon. We have a good, good next unit in. I think we do it. Yep, we're close to three star razor. We still have a 25% chance. Yeah, we do it. We do it. I might even put ogre in. Double ogre over the Luna. Thinking. Get the bloodlust going faster. I don't think it makes a difference. I think this might be better. Okay, yes. If I can get three star ogre, I'm I'll be happy about that. I'm actually gonna roll down. I'm gonna roll down. Let's go. Yes? Come on, game. Throw me a high five. You hate me so much all the time. This is your moment to make it up to me. Okay, we're gonna stay here. We're gonna stay. I'm gonna do this. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're okay. We're okay. Abaddon and Morphling. They're low priority right now. Three-star Magnus, that is with the Druid bonus, of course. 
Uh, Nature's Prophet locked down by Rayleigh. Good job. Another cast by Rayleigh. Good, good job, Luna. See you later. Is she gonna die? She won't die, but she's pretty hurt. There's the stun. Rayleigh's gonna get another cast off. I can't believe this Magnus is still up. Come on. We're gonna get the win here. Another win. We are win streaking. Good job, team. And I know I've not picked up Lifestealer yet. It's because in terms of, like, money, I don't want to hold on to units we don't quite need. We don't, like, we need him, but he, him and uh, Abaddon go on together. This Luna is really freaking me out here. He's got no money, though. He has no money, so he's completely blown up his economy. I'm pulling Lunas out of the shop, so he's just rolling hard. So I'm going to keep rolling hard, too, but I'm going to maintain my economy. Oh, no. We got to hold Morphling over, over Lifestealer. If we weren't wind streaking, I would, uh, oh, Bristle 3 star, no way. Wait, 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 oh, wow. And you made a, okay, so Earth Spirit, so guys are getting 3 stars right now. So the roll odds have definitely impacted the game, because that was relatively uncommon. Huge heals! Oh no! Our mages, it's very hard for our mages to contest with healing like that, because of the burst DPS we do. Wow. So I think we're going to lose this. Win streak might be over. Mr. Spike is going to get us back. He is going to get us back. Yeah, Mr. Spike, you got us. Good job. Good job. Nine damage. You did it. You broke up our streak. Good work. Good work. This guy still has not pulled the Luna, which is exactly what I need. This guy's holding this one for no reason. You know what? It might actually be good, because if he's going to hold Luna, and he's going to make it so that it's harder for... Uh, who was it? This guy? Positioning is very odd. Very odd. Ooh. I have to take Mask right now. No. I'll take Octrine. Now, I know with Luna, but I want to three-star her. We can't use a Mask of Madness for her. Of course, we have Lifestealer as well that would have benefited from the Mask of Madness. But I'll give him a Moon Shard. If I know, Moon Shard gets the Luna as well. But this here, I might give it to Rayleigh. Will she... I want to check her mana. I'm going to check this. I'm going to check this. I want to see how often she's going to get Frostbite off. Come on. Razor, damn it. I'm on a roll, but I want to buy that Abaddon. And Ogre Magi. We're close. We are close. But we got to be careful. There's the boots. Yeah, Void Stone's more appropriate on Crystal Maiden. She hasn't even casted Frostbite yet. Now there it is. Now she's going to take more damage here. Now she's going to Frostbite again. She's going to Frostbite again. So now that she's being heavily hit... No, don't die! What happened? Was that a Marana? How did she get that stunned? I got to watch that back. What happened to my Crystal Maiden? She was blackout stunned that entire time. Unbelievable. Alright. Here we go. More appropriate. We'll have him blink around. He's contested though, isn't he? He is still, right? We need him to get a limited 18 health. Once he's gone, and that guy too. Why are you holding him on the bench? He's trying to mess us up. Okay, we take that. Okay, yes. Okay, now we do this. I'm gonna actually use her as straight up bait right now. No, no, no. I'm gonna take her off. Vanguard here. I'm gonna protect him. So, and I'm gonna take this as well. So he could have. He probably should have went in for the razor or whatever. I had thinking to do. Okay. Come on, Magi. Make me proud. One more cast. Yes. Pretty much everyone's bloodlust. That's it. Yes, things are coming together. The plan's working. So basically, Ogre Magi has a 75... I know I'm blocking it. 75% chance to uh, multicast his ability to two targets. He has a uh, cooldown of 3.5 seconds thanks to the Octarine. Very glad I took that uh, Octarine. Okay. Morphling in here. Switch this. No, he's... Will he be able to attack? Should be fine. He'll shift up. I want him protected. But I want him... We'll, we'll put him there. 
Okay. I'm tempted by the razor, but I think we should level. We have a good next unit in. Look at this. Look at this! Look at that! Yeah, so we, we move towards leveling here. Here's the problem. So, Luna's contested. It's gonna be very hard. Look, even here. Look at that. That's me, of course. It's gonna be very hard. This guy's in trouble. Bloody now. We can eliminate this guy right now, but he's got a lineup and a half! Come on! That was a good Delta Slam, too. A pretty good one. Take Jewel down. Jewel's down. Keep going, Magi. Let's go. Come on, Rayleigh. Slardar's bashing. He's angry. He's angry. Can we beat this guy? Come on. I want him gone. I want him out of the game. Well, we're not going to do enough damage to him now. We might win? It's close. He's on the mango tree, but he's eating mangoes. Don't eat my mangoes. You got to pay for that. Yes. No. I hit the button because I didn't know what to do. That was incredibly tight. Wow. Wow. That was absolutely incredible. Okay, we're still one off from six mages too, by the way. Which is kind of important. We need to get six mages in. If we, if we see a keeper, keeper has to get in there. So we do have to level. We cannot stay and keep re-rolling as much as I would like to. Might actually just take this level. Take the level. We take a life stealer. It's gonna cost us money. But it's okay. We're gonna activate multiple uh, things here. Now we don't have any assassins jumping, so I'm gonna put actually I'm gonna do this. That's fine. Life steal is gonna apply a couple bonuses and blow up. Okay. We'll take the storm. Come on, we can beat this guy. Life Stealer is shielded. Applying that sweet, sweet brute bonus. Come on, Rayleigh. Hey, wakey, wakey. She's broken. But this guy is destroyed. Boom shakalaka. We almost knocked him. Okay, I want to get. I want this guy knocked. And we need this guy out. Oh, he won. So because he is contesting Storm Spirit right now, which is a problem. So I'm gonna hold Storm Spirit. Why? Why is this guy holding so many Storm Spirits for no reason? The guy we just beat. What is happening in this game? Crack is on top. Look at these three stars. So they've definitely changed the odds in this game. Refresher, have to, right? Could even refresh Hoker Magi. That would be ludicrous. All right, took Refresher. We're gonna put this over here. I'm going to swap this like this. Okay, hold on. I gotta make a few other changes. Let's see how we do here. Let's see how we do. Come on! We can do this! Come on, there's a refresher. Multiple frostbites. Let's go, let's go. Not as high impact as you perhaps hopes for, but still. It's probably the best we have going right now. Look at this. Everyone's being frostbitten and locked down. Yes! Yes! It's exactly what we need. Exactly what we need, and I'm gonna cut you ahead to round 22. All right, we take Morphling. Let's restart. All right, so a few guys went down. Mr. Spike went down, as did him, which is great. That means that we can go after our uh, our dear friend, Mr. Storm Spirit. Um, I'm actually going to fix this because that's a disaster. I might actually move. No, I'm gonna keep them where they are. Okay, we're gonna stay here for a second. We gotta get to eight. So now we, we're in a situation where we gotta level a bit. It sucks because we could pull Razor. It's very hard to pull Luna. I'm literally just holding on to Luna without using her. Which is kind of maddening. But that's, that's what we have to do right now. This is the number one guy. He's the guy contesting our Lunas. Can we beat him? I think we can. I think we can. Ogre, Ogre Magi is absolutely carrying us right now as is Crystal Maiden. Come on. Come on, Rayleigh. Yes! 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 He's on fire! It's exactly what we need to do. That's exactly what we need to do to win games. Might actually even no, I'm not gonna push date. We're on a we're on a streak here. We're kind of established that we can more or less beat everyone. Look at this board. He's gone. See you later. 
So all those Lunas are back in the shop. Actually, that's bad because he's probably going to pull a Luna too. How many Lunas do you have on the bench? Come on, game. He doesn't have any Lunas on the bench. We need to deny Luna. Abaddon. What are the chances we can three-star Abaddon? It's kind of a lot of money to invest in a unit. So Abaddon's not in there. He is. That's me. My Abaddon. He's the only one. No. I don't think I chase Abaddon right now. I'm going to hold him, but there's a good chance I sell him at the end of the next round. Because we have to have our priorities set. More flings uncontested as well. Abaddon's uncontested. We have a lot of units, that we, but we can't do it all. We simply can't do it all. So here's all the... Okay, this is problematic. So his lineup hurts our Crystal Maiden because she's going to be locking down bears and stuff. But we're still going to hit him hard. It's this Ogre Magi. He's absolutely carrying us. So we've now established that we can win this game. We can beat everyone here. So now what we got to do is we got to be smart. We got to make sure we level. We got to make sure we have the best uh, board we can. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to level. We're taking it. Uh, Luna's probably the next best available. If we can three star Abaddon, I might even put double Abaddon on. But uh, ideally, we want like a Lich. Where's Lich at? Where's Keeper of the Light? RNG has not been that good to us. It's been like fair. RNG's been fair. But realistically, come on. Come on. So I'm going to put her beside him. I think this through here. He's there. He's there. I'm going to switch these. He's going to waveform. He's going to run up. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do this. No. If Lifestealer just dies, it doesn't matter. He's activating the Brute Bonus. I might even put him here. He's simply activating the Brute Bonus right now. I might sell these guys off. I'm debating. I'm not selling off Luna. I still have a dream. If I can get to 3-star Luna, I will. Luna, okay, double Bloodlust there. Luna does not have the Moon Shard that would benefit her. Come on. Refresher on Rayleigh. Now, bear in mind, that's going to lose a little bit of strength over time. This guy might get us here. He's doing a good job. Come on. Yeah, he got us. It's unfortunate, but he did get us here. And take down that Luna. It's not going to be enough. It's not going to be enough. 13 damage. It's a lot of damage. But again, we have a bit of... Uh, actually, we have a bit of an economy advantage. We do. Let's see what we get here. This lifestealer is really awkward and not having an additional mage. So what I think we do here... We're not against... We do, we do have brawnies. Two brawnies, though. I don't think we take it. I think we take Moonshard. Moonshard's going to be better. I think we need to protect her more. You know what? I think I'm off Brutes. Wait. Okay. All right. So we're going to chase three-star Abaddon. We're off Morphling for now. Let's hold on to Storm Spirit as well. Now we're at six mages. That's a pretty big power spike. We have a lot of mage, uh, mages, of course. It's a lot of extra damage. It helps Rayleigh. It helps everybody. So it's a big DPS spike for us. And we're going to hit this guy good. There it is. Good job. So I'm actually going to continue to click into leveling Razor. So we've really dropped our, our uh, chance to get Razor. So we're kind of just circumstantially getting him if we can. But we have maximized our opportunity to get uh, Abaddon because now he's at 35%. So we're actually going to chase that Abaddon, aren't we? Chase that three-star Abaddon. Look at this. Everyone's got three-star units now. You never saw that. If you saw someone with a three-star unit, you're like, wow, blessed by RNG. Must be nice, man. And now look at us. So let's check contention here. Who cares? Beautiful. 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 See this? That's the problem. Have we at least locked him out? We have locked him out. He is so mad. So, okay, we... Morphling, too. I think we might just... I might just roll this for the Razor. All units I want! Yes! Now who's blessed by the RNG? I'm actually gonna do this. There. Nope. I'm glad I didn't actually take that. You get that. Rayleigh still has the Refresh Orb because it was too late. Oh, this is the guy that we needed to beat too! Damn it! 
So Razor is now stealing damage with every single attack. It's permanent on the uh, opposition, and uh, every time he switches targets, he gets a bonus. Look at this! Yes! Yes! We are absolutely crushing this guy, and Mr. Crack was the one that we were most worried about. We take this, of course. Can we three-star... Six mages. The build's coming together. Now, I know you're like, Alex, Luna, why would you... I'm actually going to put on Abaddon. I'm actually taking off Luna altogether, putting on Abaddon. And he's out. That means all those Lunas are back. All those Lunas are back. So this is great. Great news for us. Um, we are going to chase Luna and Storm Spirit. Do I stay at level 8? No. Uh, you know what? I can totally punish these guys. Okay. Next level, we're going to level to 9. We'll put Luna in. We could even do it now. No. Yes? I can win the game right here if I level to 9. Get Luna in. Let's wait. Let's wait. I seal the game at level 9. We could win this right here, though. I think we can beat this guy. Cracks lineup's a little better. That's it. Because remember, Abaddon's shield is doing magic-based damage. So his shield is being improved as well. And look at that Keeper of the Light. He's angry. He's attacking fast. Good work. Yes! We are absolutely demolishing these guys. That's exactly what I want to see. That's it. Come on. We're going to get the win here or what? I kind of don't want to win. I want to face him one more time. So Crack has a little bit of life left in him. Good job. Good job, Crack. You did it. All right. All right, guys. Here's the moment. This is when I, I, re I uh, regret my words, where Crack beats me like twice in a row and I completely throw the game. <gasps> That's a problem. See? I regret it already. Regret it already. Look at this! See? I'm gonna get punished. I'm getting punished right now. You're gonna see live punishment occurring from my smack talk. <gasps> no! <laughs> I didn't have enough time! He's lucky though. I still, I still think our lineup's probably a bit better, but he had a huge damage spike. There's the chicken. But it's not gonna be enough! We got him! Three star Abaddon coming in on the bench. We might not need him. Yeah, we got him. We got him. Razor leading the way. Three star Razor. Unbelievable. Good job, guys. And there's the dub. There's the dub. What a build! I knew this build was fantastic. I knew it! It's one of those builds that when you see it on paper, you're like, this has to be, this is too good to be true. It is too good to be true, and it was absolutely fantastic. It did exactly what I expected to do. Thank you so much for watching, and a very special thank you to all of my wonderful subscribers. Take care, everyone, and have yourselves an absolutely wonderful day.